Alright, hey guys, I'm here with a Diablo 3 Hardcore Level 30 Trophy Guide. Uh, it's a very basic guide, just going to go over a few uh, essentials to let you know how you can do Hardcore mode and get this Level 30 uh, Trophy easy. I'm playing the PS3 version of Diablo 3. It, uh, was, uh, it was released on September 3rd, 2013. All right, so f the first uh, tip is to play on easy difficulty and uh, play with a monk. The reason you want to play with a monk is it's the only character with a healing spell, and it can acquire a perk to gain health and heal uh, every time you perform a special attack. Uh, you also, at later levels, get a mantra of healing, which um, is an active spell with little maintenance that constantly heals your health so once a level you activate it and for the rest of the level it'll act, uh, keep your health up and it, it's really useful so uh, the main reasons to play on easy though are versatility with equipment you can equip items to earn more experience as opposed to uh, having to maximize your armor vitality or uh, attribute points like intelligence strength stuff like that um, you also don't have to worry as much when you're playing on co-op um, so if you're playing with one two three other people for that 10 20 30 percent bonus experience um, you know you can do it with a little more ease of mind that you're not going to run into too many more challenges especially if you're all playing as monks and you have like the mantra of healing going um, uh, nonetheless if you're having trouble with acts one and two on a co-op mode you're going to want to switch to uh, single player for the later acts. Um, the reason you want to do this is so if you get in trouble in a single player game, you can always hit start and quit and not have to worry about uh, dying. You know, because if your hardcore character dies, you have to restart again, like from level zero. So, you know, it might, you might build experience a little slower, but it'll help you out in the end. Um, also on top of that, I have a helm that I got as a pre-order bonus that gives me 25% experience. So if I'm playing with a three level or three person team on co-op, uh, that's 55% more experience. So, I mean, that'll help you level up a lot faster too. Um, if you follow these tactics, you should be able to complete the game at level 30. Um, I personally... I personally achieved level 30 with this character by the end of Act 3. Um, I did, however, explore as many dungeons, side quests um, as possible. And I got, as, when I saw lore books and journals, I got them as well. So anyway, I hope this helps. Um, thanks for listening. If you have any suggestions, feel free to comment. Uh, or message me and I'll re-edit the video and th throw them on here with some credit. Uh, once again, thanks, and peace.